Hi, this is Marcia with Blessed and Oiled. And today I wanted to talk to you about cassia. It might be an oil you haven't heard of before. Previously, the only way you could order cassia was in the oils of the scripture collection. Well, Young Living just released it uh, for a limited time only to be sold on its own. So it was the first time I had tried it. And I have to say, I love it so much. I had to share it with you. Um, straight out of the bottle, I don't love it as much as diffusing it. If there was ever an oil made for the diffuser, it's cassia. I would say that it smells a little bit like cinnamon bark in the diffuser. And any place you would use cinnamon bark in the diffuser, whatever your favorite cinnamon bark blend is, is how you would use cassia. However, the price point of cassia is amazing. It's a 15 ml and it's $23.75 wholesale compared to cinnamon bark, which you can only get in a 5 ml and it's $25.75. So cassia is almost a third of the cost of cinnamon bark when you price it out per drop. So let's talk a little bit more about it, shall we? So I pulled out my fabulous Aaron Rodgers Oils of the Scripture book. And cats, the first thing we need to know is that if you're going to use cassia topically, it's even hotter than cinnamon bark. So you're definitely going to need to use a carrier oil with it. Um, and if you want to look up where in the Bible, you're going to look up Ezekiel 27, 19. Um, it's typically known as an oil of gladness for its emotional uplifting uh, effects. So it's perfect for diffusing. I mean, who doesn't need happy emotions in their diffuser? Especially after this last year and a half. Happy emotions, please. All the happy. Um, and then it uh, has also been shown to uh, support the digestive system and improve blood circulation. Now let's talk about if you were going to diffuse cassia, how you would diffuse it. I've been playing around with it for you this last week. I love it with thieves. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing with thieves. So if you want to write these down, go ahead. Um, I will also put it in the notes, in the comments. So four drops of thieves with three drops of cassia in your favorite Young Living diffuser. Um, it smells amazing with orange. So five drops of orange with four drops of cassia. You could totally do thieves, cassia, and orange um, however you want. I always encourage you to play around. Don't ever take my word for how many drops of anything. Um, you do you. And if you want it to be a little bit different, play around with it. The surprising one is Cassia and Stress Away. And I did way more Stress Away than Cassia. So I did seven drops of Stress Away and three drops of Cassia. It also smells great with Northern Lights Black Spruce. So that is four drops um, Northern Lights Black Spruce with an equal amount of four drops Cassia. I still do not have cardamom essential oil, but my friend tells me adding cardamom um, to that blend is pretty amazing as well. So it's a limited time only oil. I would highly encourage you to add one or two bottles of it to your, I know, summer order because it may not be in stock by the time fall rolls around. I like fall scents year round, um, but it is the perfect, like if you want your house to smell like grandma's cinnamon rolls, 
you need you some cassia because it's way better to smell grandma's cinnamon rolls than to eat grandma's cinnamon rolls. Get me back if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.